Massive LEGO leaks, never before seen sets from Sonic to new LEGO Star Wars sets and even a new LEGO train. Over the last years, LEGO has had a problem. Leaks. Leaks have had a profound impact on the LEGO company, with them even trying to do damage control. And some of your favorite creators have created a whole brand around them. But there are also times that LEGO themselves accidentally leak stuff. And that happens more often than not. So this week, Promo Bricks revealed a new LEGO Star Wars set coming soon. We have the Venator Destroyer for about $650. Yeah, I'm not buying that. A smaller Republic gunship for only $140. The Ghost, no, not Casper. This will retail for a rumored $170 and will come with Hara, Chopper, Quarry and another figure as well. And finally, my favorite, the Republic Swamp Speeder for $25. Finally, something most of us can afford. The best looking set has got to be this one because it's the one we have images for. Mandalorian Funk vs TIE Interceptor. With two spaceship, this looks like a very cool set, with some very interesting minifigures. Additionally, there will also be a $70 Ahsoka T6 shuttle. According to some guy on Reddit that 1414 Falcon thinks is worth trusting, LEGO will be remaking one of its most iconic sets, the El Dorado Fortress, rumored to be releasing in July for around $200. Maybe it will go well with the Barracuda. We have an update on that rumored LEGO Sonic theme. If you didn't know, LEGO is making a Sonic theme. Some new information says that we'll get Tails minifigure, which is this guy, and a new mode for Dr. Robotics, or whatever he's called now. This guy also said that we will get a set based on the new Star Wars show, Ahsoka. This will cost $100, and also a new Boba Fett Mac for some reason, because LEGO needs to make Max for everything now. Maybe someday we'll have a LEGO City Mac. But LEGO leaks can also bring problems, guys. Have you ever thought that LEGO leaks could have an impact on LEGO sales? With LEGO sets being leaked early, it could influence the people that actually buy the set. But since LEGO is a private company, we don't have access to that data, so this is just speculation. But that would explain why LEGO is trying so hard to crack down on leaks. However, it could also be that LEGO is trying to keep their intellectual property in check. We also have rumors saying that LEGO will be doing a new Disney castle. So remember that Walt Disney World castle from a few years ago? Well, apparently LEGO is doing another one for $400. If I had to guess, I would say it is the Disneyland castle because of the rumored price tag. Though I would like to see a Disneyland Paris castle someday. We're getting a brick built Beauty and the Beast set as well. LEGO will also be getting rid of the iconic Pick a Brick Wall Cup, which you could pick up pieces and put them inside. It was a great value. Now they are getting ready for a new thing, which is a cardboard box. Apparently it can fit even more bricks, so that's a good thing. And it's supposed to help the environment. Expect to see one in your LEGO store in the near future. I hope she made lots of spaghetti! Another huge set is the Avengers Tower for about, get ready guys, $525. Yeah, say goodbye to your wallet. This has got to be one of the most anticipated set by LEGO Marvel fans. All of these seem to be too good to be true. Personally, I would wait for more information, or when LEGO themselves reveals it. And that is the other problem with LEGO leaks. How can you trust it? I'm not a leaker, I just get the information that other leakers get, but how do you know if it is real? Well, you don't, I don't know if it is real, I just wait until the set comes out. Because even if the leak is accurate, LEGO might just cancel the set. The thing about leaks is that you need to keep a grain of salt or maybe even a whole bottle of it. Sets like the Avengers Towers have been rumored for a long time. <laughs> Serious? Harry Potter is one of the most anticipated LEGO themes when it comes to leaks. We're getting a mini Diagon Alley with that candy shop that we got last time for $90. It is a play version this time. And yes, guys, the main news, we're getting a new LEGO train. That being the all-new LEGO Hogwarts Express. Again, but I'm not complaining. This will be a smaller version, unlike that super expensive one, with a Hogsmeade station. This will likely make the set a bit more expensive. 
This will likely make the set more interesting for fans, even LEGO Trains fans. So are you excited to get a new LEGO train? Let me know in the comments below. It is awesome seeing LEGO making more trains because trains were such an important part of the LEGO brand. It is also awesome seeing LEGO making relatively cheaper sets compared to the $400 ones. So we have taken a look at LEGO leaks, but there were also other leaked information like this set. Thanks to Brick Clicker, we have new info on the X Wing Fighter. It's going to be 27 centimeters high and 55 centimeters long. The box art looks a little different than usual. We have a windshield which is printed, but cockpit details they use stickers, unfortunately. Minifigures seem to be Luke Skywalker and R2D2. It's going to cost $240 and come out near May 1st, guys. Are you excited for this set? However, LEGO Leaks pose a huge threat to the LEGO community. The problem with LEGO Leaks, with great expectation comes great responsibilities. Let me pose you an example. The new LEGO Liber, uh, well, however you say that, Liber. this new Technic set was originally rumored for $450, however the new rumored price is $680 with the same piece count and it's going to be smaller apparently at 99 centimeters instead of one meter and this is the problem with lego leaks how do you know you want something before it even comes to reality you end up using your imagination of course and because of that most of the time you think of something that is better than the actual set, like the rumored LEGO Botanical Garden for $110, which many think will look something like this, however, we don't know until it releases, apparently it's part of the Botanical line of course. Just like the new rumored Marvel minifigure series too, that apparently will have Hawkeye, Kate Bishop, and no, she is not a bishop, Moon Knight, Mr. Knight, Agatha, the Mimi Woman, Werewolf, Storm from X-Men, Beast from the X-Men, Wolverine, all of these X-Men figures are based on the animated series by the way, Echo, Kang, and uh, She-Hulk. Oh no. Expert at controlling my anger because I do it infinitely more than you. The series is rumored to get the new boxes which have been rumored for a long time of course. That's the thing with LEGO Leaks, you don't know if it will happen, there is only one thing you can actually do, and that is enjoy the now. Your life is not going to be better because LEGO is releasing a new train. You already have everything you need to be happy, you just need to find the how. Now, if you want to learn something about LEGO, like building LEGO techniques, click the video on the screen right now. See you there guys.